Hello mis amigos and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing great. I hope you're having an amazing day and today it's time for food. I'm gonna show you food. You're gonna get some food and here's some food. <laughs> Mm. Or so I think. I don't really know what this video will turn into. And looking back, I guess I also didn't know what this color situation is because it definitely is not it. But I'm planning to show you guys what I eat in a day. Here's a little trigger warning. Obviously in this video I will be talking a lot about food. And also in the beginning of the video I will briefly mention my personal struggles with food. But after that this video will be more like a vlog but very food related obviously. So I hope you're excited to follow me around today and discover whatever adventures lie ahead of us and whatever adventure that may be i hope we have fun <laughs> a little backstory about my day-to-day -day food i'm trying to be healthy at the moment actually i don't think it's at the moment anymore i've been eating very healthy i would say for the last five months now and it's starting to become normal for me not gonna lie sometimes i feel like it has become a real problem because food has always kind of sort of been a struggle for me and I'm not trying to overanalyze myself but I tend to go into extremes when it comes to food so I'm hoping that I'm not doing that at the moment but I'm happy that I'm eating healthier now and I'm also trying to gain weight so I'm trying to eat more food anyway when did it get so deep I just wanted to show you guys what I'm eating so let's just get breakfast now okay it's 702 in the morning and Vincent doesn't want to speak he also doesn't want to show himself because it should be all about the food. So he slices an apple and he slices his cake. We never forget to wash your hands and put some oats in the bowl. Why am I doing this? Well anyway, I guess I must have read somewhere that flax seeds are healthy because I started putting them in my oats and haven't really noticed a change, but we're just gonna pretend that we did. I also like to eat my oats with mall nuts and then we just add some cinnamon and milk and we're good to go. <gasps> never forget the best thing though. You are empty. Wow, that transition really worked very well. Well, to start my day, I really like watching Apex streams while I'm eating my breakfast, drinking my coffee, and drinking one liter of water. Then usually it's time to cuddle a little bit with Chili, because that's the only time he really ever wants to be in my room, because Naomi isn't awake yet, and therefore her door isn't open. Chili always hurts me when he cool doors. I haven't tried it yet. Hello. <gasps> He's breaking free! Well, and after I've tried to do a workout, it's time for my late morning snack, which is usually a smoothie. And I just put some sort of berries in there, some more oats, peanut butter, some mint, and water. Oh. Meanwhile, they're having these delicious croffles or whatever they're called. But I guess I'm gonna just enjoy my smoothie <laughs> while enjoying the side of chili. What is he doing? Yes, I accept your condolences because although I hate going grocery shopping, I just hate leaving the house. Unfortunately, I did not have any food left at home and so I had to go. I walked, saw some questionable stuff, put some questionable stuff in my cart, and went home. Look guys, this is everything I got. We've got vegetables, fruits, this isn't fruit, this isn't fruit either. <laughs> they didn't have oat milk, which is a shame, but I like coconut. Nutties, some dried tomatoes, olives, because I love olives. Then we've got- <gasps> No, I forgot something. I wanted to make wraps tonight. Oh, let's just grab everything that I need for lunch because I'm hungry now. Guys, I finally have dark chocolate again. Last week I accidentally bought milk chocolate and I don't like milk chocolate. I only like dark chocolate and I'll finally have it again. So unfortunately I still have some leftover pasta from yesterday so I have to eat that up. I say unfortunately because it's not a lot and this will still leave me hungry afterwards. But I'm just gonna pair it with a lot of vegetables to make up for it hopefully. This is what I usually have for lunch. I'll just chop up whatever vegetable I can find and feel like eating that day. Today it's some zucchini and Carrots! Oh my god, <laughs> why could I not think of carrots? Tomatoes, some dried tomatoes, and we've got some onions and big garlic pieces here because that's how I like it actually. I like to bite some garlic pieces. Now we're just gonna get a pan, put a little bit of olive oil in there, and heat this fish up. 
Now we're gonna add the onion and a little bit of the garlic, just for a couple of minutes. <laughs> minions, just for a couple of minutes. I also accidentally put a little bit of the dry tomato in there, but we don't really care, care, care in the air, yeah. Now because I love tomato, we're gonna put some tomato paste in there as well. By the way, no way is this any form of gourmet cooking or anything like that. This is no crazy recipe. This is just what I eat each day, basically. <laughs> Cool. Now we shall add the zucchini and the carrots. We might add a little bit of water. And ever since I found it, I add tahin to everything that I make. <laughs> I don't care if it goes well with it. I think it goes well with everything, so I just put it to everything. Don't hate me. Please don't hate me for this. We're gonna add the tomatoes and some olives. And then it looks like this when we add this really dry pasta. Lastly, when your food is cold because you can't stand the look of your unclean kitchen, you can add some nutties and then you can finally eat your cold food. <laughs> Yay, it looks like, I don't even know what. <laughs> now I'm gonna just drink some more water. I'm on my third liter now. I try to drink about four liters a day, which has gotten really easy actually. <laughs> Be that as it may, now it's time to play some Apex. <laughs> I see you for snack time. Guys, it's snack time! <gasps> My favorite, because that also means I get to drink another coffee. I'm not very creative when it comes to my afternoon snack. I will either have, uh, what are they called? Do you have these in other countries? <laughs> but I only have one left and that is not enough, so I'm gonna eat that <laughs> and a little bit of bread. Then we need peanut butter and banana. Do you guys like your peanut butter smooth or crunchy? Then we cut this. This is so not ripe. Just pretend it is like we usually do. Banana, I didn't even, ah! and you can't even see, but I'm just placing the banana on top. Now onto some agave syrup, and lastly some cinnamon on top, and this is so good. This tastes fucking amazing, and it's healthy too, I think. Don't quote me on that, but I don't know why it wouldn't be healthy. Now onto the best part. <laughs> and now we get to enjoy this. Sorry, you don't want to see me enjoying myself too much, so I'm gonna be back soon. Look, I found babies. Oh, oh look at babies. Hello, baby. Hello, other baby. Oh, yo. Oh, cute. No, I want to see a paw. <laughs> Cute. I know everyone's reading this book at the moment, but who of you have read this? They're about to die! <laughs> Guys, I wanted to be healthy tonight! Yeah. And now we're having burgers. We're watching Love Island, Love! Yeah, we're watching Love Island. What's up, babe? You're right, babe! They're screaming enough, you don't have to scream. You're right, babe! Ah! This show is absolutely horrible. It's a uh, burger time. I'm gonna be healthy nice. again tomorrow. Burger time and fries. More burger. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, there's a burger in there. <laughs> <Hey>? <laughs> What is going on here? <laughs> All right guys, scrap the wraps. I'm gonna show you one of my favorite recipes, if not my favorite at the moment, because it's very easy to make. It tastes very good. It lasts you long if you make a lot, <laughs> and it's just good. When I stay used to eat meat, one of my favorite things to eat was spaghetti bolognese, and since I do no longer eat meat, I haven't really eaten spaghetti bolognese <laughs> until I've tried to make it with meat alternatives. Some of my tries went well, some of them went okay. Naomi prefers the version with a ground meat alternative, but I actually prefer the lentil version. So that's what we're gonna do now. And here's what you'll need. A couple of carrots, preferably more than I've got here. A little bit of tomato and celery. I like to put in a lot of celery because I don't usually eat celery and it's really healthy. So I put in a lot in there because you don't taste it as much. Garlic, onion, 125 grams of lentils, about 240 milliliters of vegetable stock, and also some canned tomato. And then just spices and that's it. Technically, I would also put in a couple of mushrooms but I don't have mushrooms, so no short rooms tonight. Don't take that out of context. And now basically you just put it all in a pan and stir. <laughs> but there's an order, I guess, so <laughs> I'm gonna show you that order. Oil. Eat this fish up. Add some onions once it's nice and warm. 
Bisschen glasig sind. You also need tomato paste. Add the carrots and technically the mushrooms as well. And let that fry for about six minutes. I almost forgot the celery. Also add that. Technically you should have more carrots than celery, but... Then add the tomato paste and whatever spices you want to add. <laughs> oh, and the garlic, obviously. Whoopsies. And then you add the rest, so the tomatoes. And now let that simmer for at least 20 minutes, but I'd say two hours is good. I see you when we get to eat it. Dinner served! So good. Whoops, I've only just realized that I forgot to film an outro, but what kind of outro could be better than watching myself eat? I can think of many. <laughs> anyway, I know this video was a little bit random, but every now and then I do enjoy doing vlog type of videos, and I hope you do too. I also know that I basically only ate oats, peanut butter, and pasta in this video, and surely this must have been very inspiring. <laughs> However, it is time for me to say adios now, so I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. Y entonces, nos vemos la próxima. Betty, bye!